Hey guys, today we're on episode 2 of World Edit, and today it's all about shapes and stuff like that. So this is also going to be putting various different shapes on tools, so you can just right click anywhere and spawn them. But before that we're going to just using commands to spawn shapes. So there's five different things we're going to go through. First is the pyramid, so the command is forward slash pyramid like that, the block say 24 colon 1 and the size, so let's just do a small one just to show you and if we get out of this we can see it has spawned a nice little pyramid but if you want to go even further you can do um, percentages which I'm going to go through in another video but it will look like this so let's go upwards and have a look at what we've created and this looks really nice, maybe from an adventure map. It takes two seconds to create and it looks like you've spent ages on it, which is great. Anyway, onwards to cylinders. So, there's a couple of things with this. You can either um, make hollow cylinders or full ones. So let's make a uh, hollow one to begin with. HCYL, short for cylinder, and the H is for hollow block type 20 and then the radius which is half the diameter if you didn't know so look there we go nice small circle that's done if you want to make it completely glass you can do forward slash cyl without the h 20 and then say 10 so all of that and finally with cylinders you can put another number on the end which is height so if we break up it's now five blocks high there we go. So yeah, that, that's really, really helpful. Finally is spheres. So you can do H sphere, um, seven, five. See, look, nice bedrock uh, sphere here. And you can also do, obviously, a hollow. Well, uh, one that's not hollow. So let's do that. Which is probably quite bad. Ah, let me out. Ah, see, look, there we go. That one's only useful for making like terrain and world, world of hitting different mountains and stuff. Which is where this comes in. So to put it on a pickaxe, you're going to want to, or any tool for that matter, you're going to want to use a brush. So you do forward slash BR, and this shows you all the ones you can go through. So the ones I mainly use is obviously smooth and cylinder. So I'm going to show you smooth to begin with. So you do BR smooth. Uh, or brush and then you do the size so I'm going to do 5 so you can obviously go around right clicking sorting out the terrain which actually that looks a lot nicer so it, it sometimes messes up but usually it's okay however you can mask stuff so if you only want it to affect sand you do mask and 12 there we go it won't affect if I right click over there it won't affect any grass or anything like that uh, let's check out the sphere tool and 5, 5 actually let's do 12 12, 5 here we go so you can just right click about and it will spawn load of these and it can lag you I shouldn't have done that yeah so be careful with that uh, also the final thing is obviously cylinders CYL55 five, five. oh maybe not so look here we go see that here we go very nice works really well nice undo so that's all to do with um, locks and shapes and stuff and I think there is also butcher so if you Spawn loads of mobs, spawn mob zombie. And then we right click, yeah, it kills them. So that's very useful for hordes of zombies. So thank you for watching. Episode 3 will be on percentages, which I gave you a sneak peek today. Let's do this. Goodbye.